Uh, yeah, right, hello. Uh, yeah. <coughs> uh, uh, as I just told B, I'm rather tired. And when I get tired, I can get irritable, so call it B, please. I know, I type things I shouldn't. Mm -hmm. That's me. Because tomorrow I'm looking forward and a great trepidation to the blood tests for diabetes and kidney problems and everything else. And oh God, when that needle sinks into the flesh, people say to me, Oh, needles never bother me. I say to them, Well, you must have skin like a fucking rhino then or an elephant. When a needle of course, they can't use little thin needles when they're drawing blood. You know, she fills about four or five capsules of blood. Almost an armful. <laughs> and I say, please, just get on with it. I hate this and find the right spot first time. I hate it when they say, after they stuck the needle in, because I try to relax. You know, if you tense, the blood won't uh, flow. And then the last time she says, oh, I, can't. I said, oh my God, this is what I didn't want to happen. Just get the bloody blood out and let's get it over with. All right, Mr. Tadell, calm down, calm down. So hopefully tomorrow I'll sit there all relax. She'll stick the bloody needle in, take what blood she wants. Of course, fast. I have to go to bed. I can only drink water. In the morning, I shall feel hungry. But after I've been to the clinic, uh, I shall go in the cafe and I have my breakfast. And uh, this disability living allowance, it's got to be reviewed. Is that the right word? And they sent me that long form. Well, our continuity warden, she's a specialist. She's a coloured lady large and uh, she's a specialist at filling these forms in and she says leave it to me if they ask because I have my hip joints replaced if they ask you if you can walk don't click yes because you you can't say yes I can walk with great difficulty or with some difficulty no she says uh, she says anyway she says anyway leave it to me so I'm going to see her tomorrow at midday and she's going to fill that for me then next week, after the get the results of my blood tests, I want the doctors to give me a list of my ailments, which I shall photocopy and send it off with a form. And hopefully next February, when my benefits are due to stop, they will continue. I try to ring you, Dave, and once again you're on the fucking phone, aren't you? So if you see this, this doesn't affect Christmas. That is already booked up. The car is booked. The large automatic car, large automatic gearbox car. Uh, I like the car. I like a car like the mayor's got. A big Jag, isn't it? Is it a Jag? I would think that's automatic as well. So anyway, all this doesn't affect Christmas, that is already pre-planned, pre-booked. It's when it comes to February. And I don't want to lose that money. Because she says, what other ailments have you got? I says, spinal stenosis. If you look up on Google, spinal stenosis. It's a narrowing of the... What? A narrowing of the spinal channel, preventing blood flow through to the muscles, as well as diabetes, kidney problems, you know, hopefully. I should continue to get the money. Hmm. If I lose it, well, that'll be it. I won't be doing any more trips down to Cornwall in hired cars. But, you know, got to be positive. I shall remain positive and optimistic. The mayor and a new friend turned up, Kitty. She looked rather nice. 
helpful. And uh, we're going to light up by our, yeah, fuck it, why worry? <coughs> we're going to light up, yeah. Uh, but what I say just for that? I can't remember, it's gone. I'm tired. Uh, I think I better go to bed. Mind you, it's quite early, nine o'clock, but by the time I've washed the pots, put the new clean work cover on my bed, and uh, had a shower, by the time I get in bed, it could be off 10, 11. Yeah, so. Of course, the thing is, I spent too long on this computer, you know, staring at this screen, this small screen, and the glasses need adjusting because they keep dropping down. Have you noticed? I have to keep lifting them. So I'm looking at the screen, I'm not looking through the glasses, unless I've got to read some of it. Yeah. Uh, what else can I say? I'm sure I can find something to say. I did lose interest eventually in the spiritualist movement because I, I felt there's nothing any mediums there's nothing else any mediums could tell me that I don't know already I've read me I've read many books on the subject one brought my father back to me I didn't know him at all he, 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 he didn't know me except for the introduction you know Arthur he said your father I said what him. He says he worked on the railways all his life, didn't he? I said, well, yeah, he did, actually. And he wasn't a very good father. I said, well, you can say that again. He says he now regrets that he didn't treat his children better. I said, I bet he does. <laughs> so I have seen many mediums. One brought my mother back. She was a transfiguration medium. She said that look into my eyes <laughs> and I did and she went all oh, the face went all funny and I caught a glimpse of my mother's features mm. yeah. transfiguration medium her name was Olive I do recall mm -hmm. down at Taunton in Somerset when I lived down there but now I've lost interest but well I say I've lost interest if I still had a car my own car, I would probably on Sunday evenings go to some of these churches, there's plenty around there, perhaps when we're down there at the Christmas Dave, uh, check one out, I know there's one at Penzance isn't there, the spiritualist church, but the trouble is, a lot of people there, the chance of the medium is going to pick you out, but you never know, they might do, yeah, so check that out Dave, when we're down there, just once, like, you know, gonna, I'm going to be down there for about a week. Uh, see if we can go to a spir spiritualist church because they often have services in the week. Um, we'll see what the medium is like. In other words, clairvoyant, you know. Some of them, they go into trance, but you know, there's plenty of charlatans. Oh, yeah. But I've seen transfig uh, I've seen mediums that go into trance, yeah. Mm -hmm. Cause there are plenty around Nottingham. And I probably would I've only lost interest now because uh, I'm not mobile and I can't go on my scooter. It's non local, no. I did at the Newstead Abbey Church do a video and put it on YouTube but uh, they found out, somebody saw it and they asked me at the church if I'd remove it please, so of course I had to lots of orbs, who was it said recently about orbs I can't remember, you know they were being sceptical of course so many sceptical people about so this is it and uh, I'm going to make a move in here, about an hour hopefully I'll be in bed Normally, yeah, I'll leave to that because I'm tired. Right, so just remember, B, if I get tired, I can get irritable, okay? God forgive me, darling. <laughs> right, I'm off. Cheers.
Cheers. Bye.